Yeah, Sandy, it was video that shocked us all. I think a lot of us watched and were just thinking, how could someone do something like that, right? Throw a dog over a fence. Well, authorities do have their suspect, but they believe that there is yet another dog that is unaccounted for right now that's linked to that same person. An arrest made after this disturbing surveillance video made its rounds. Animal lovers watching in disgust after one man tosses his eight-year-old pit bull mix over a seven-foot fence. The dog's hind legs even clipping the razor wire before making a hard landing. Moments later, you can see the dog walk to the corner of the enclosure and watch the man walk away. It happened at a cell tower in Winchester last month. Luckily, it only took a few hours for maintenance workers to discover the dog now given the name Ken. Thursday, authorities making an arrest. 30-year-old Robert Ruiz Jr. was taken into custody at his Winchester home. He was booked on suspicion of willfully abandoning his dog and for felony animal cruelty. The dog was microchipped and ultimately the chip information came back to the owner. John Welsh with Riverside County Animal Services says after the video went viral, requests started coming in from people wanting to adopt and from rescues. We know sometimes a lot of organizations will take in the animal and of course, you know, a lot of people want to help that organization. They want to write checks, they want to Venmo, you know, donations. Um, but ultimately we want to see the animal immediately into a loving home and we also don't want to upset one rescue partner over the next. Welsh says one woman came in saying she was adopting Ken or so the shelter was told. Not long thereafter, you know, it, it, a rescue organization was uh, promoting the dog on social media. That rescue is Underdog Heroes, the founder there telling KTLA that the only way they could get Ken was by being dishonest. She told us Ken going to a rescue was the better option considering he had kennel cough, a respiratory infection and other health issues a private adopter likely wouldn't know how to care for. Based on their social media post, Ken's lungs are now clear. The founder says he'll be in his new foster home by next Saturday. And this picture shared to us by Animal Services shows the suspect's three dogs. The left is Ken. The one in the middle was impounded when Ruiz was arrested. And then I'm told authorities don't know where this third dog is to the right. They believe that Ruiz also abandoned this dog. Now, meanwhile, Ken, after fostering, will be up for adoption. Reporting live in Harupa Valley, I'm Shelby Nelson, KTLA 5 News.